What did I get for Christmas last year? Wow, I, I, it's, it's blinding me. <laughs> Sorry, it's cold out here. It rained on Christmas. I heard of it snowing on Christmas and we having a white Christmas. But this is a wet Christmas. Well, this might be to a few boyfriends right now, but anyway. Huh. I can't remember what I got for the last Christmas. This is weird. Man. Okay, okay, okay. Gotta stop and think. I probably got Mario... Mario Galaxy? Maybe? I got Wii Music, which was like the stupidest game in the world. I got Sonic Unleashed, which I didn't play, actually, for some reason. And I, like, took it back, like, after I couldn't beat, like, the first couple of levels. Only reason why is because back then I really wasn't a big Sonic fan. I didn't really start becoming a real big Sonic fan until Hellfire Comms. Which, again, you guys should really read the Archie's comic. It's pretty good. That's no good. <laughs> okay. And ever since uh, four kids took over Sonic, the dub is horrible. But Sonic Unleashed was pretty good, and so is Sonic the Black Knight. And I was thinking about buying that, actually. But either or. Yeah, and I win! Suck it, suck it! Suck it, suck it, suck it, suck it! I was also watching, um... Da -da 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 -da. What's that guy? The Nostalgia Critic. He made up this awesome song. It was so good. He was just singing, and it, it was so funny. He was just singing, and it was this chick, and then she dies at the end of the video. I'm not even gonna like spoil it like this. So you guys go to Nostalgia Critic, look for like a song on there. It's it's like about five minutes. I can't remember what it was called, but look on his uh, list, and he's just basically singing, which I'm not even sure if that's his voice or not because his singing voice doesn't really sound the same as his acting voice. Which don't you hate that when they like hire people? Huh, what else can I recommend you guys do for Christmas? As I still try to think of my Christmas list from last year. Hmm. Uh. You guys should go and watch the, uh, Angry Game Nerds, uh, Bible Games videos. Because there were games called Bible Games for, like, uh, for NES and for the CDI, which were, ve were, un were illegal. Not illegal, but they were made out of... What's that called? They were made without having a license by Nintendo. So, basically, yeah, they, they, they should be screwed. They just basically took uh, games that were already released and just add in their own graphics and edited it and called it a different game. Which is what a lot of people do nowadays. But still, I mean, they did it and they released it. And they're basically just like three games in a one. But, yeah, go watch uh, Angry Video Game Nerds uh, Christmas Special, or Bible Games, which was pretty funny, actually. Because the CDI is like the worst system ever. Oh, crap, I didn't know Knuckles could swim. Wee! Dan Green is swimming! Dan Green is running up here! Ah, uh, what else? Well, I finally remember what I did get for Christmas. Um, freak. It was this DS game. I think it was Star Fox? Star Fox, uh, Command? Star Fox... I can't remember it. Star Fox... Command... Yeah, it is ca Command. <laughs> I'm an idiot. And Metroid Hunters. Which both have, like... Hunters was pretty good. Command was pretty lame, actually. So, I, I don't recommend Command, but, uh, I mean, like, this is for all the people who get all their money, like, on Christmas, and, oh, oh my gosh, we're finna hit up GameStop when I get done, and have fun, because my parents doesn't buy anything for me for Christmas, because that's what my parents did to me one year, and I got so pissed. I mean, seriously, they just gave me, like, a ton of money, but really no games. But I did get a bop it, though, and my brother got a Dreamcast. Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much all my Christmas list. Mm, ah, I might as well finish up this level. Ramble about Christmas times, Christmas past. This video is like gonna be stupidly long, so I'm gonna like like upload it in different parts of the day so different people can watch it. 
hopefully like they don't edit it out and be like, oh, you can't watch this video. Because we're YouTube and that's what we do. Because we're boobs. Ah, uh, man. Man, this is horrible. I'm getting my ass kicked on this game. <sighs> Trying to think of something to talk about. While I'm playing a water level. Like the worst water level in the world. Well, not worse than uh, Link's Water Temple in Zelda. Or Ocarina of Time. Or Ocarina of Time. I hate it when people like get pissed when like something isn't pronounced right. Don't you guys? What is that? Oh crap. Oh man, I, I should have let that play out. That was like the epic uh, countdown of Doom. It was like whenever like your character is about to die underwater, it's like. I used to be on the swim team, and they used to. Uh, I used to image that whenever I just sit underwater like for so long. Yeah, a timer would come over my head. The song would play like. They put that as nightmare fuel on TV troops. Seriously. A drowning beacon? Oh, I don't know. Maybe it is scary to some people. We Also, go see Jack Frost. The scary version of Jack Frost. Wait, no, give me a bubble. Damn it. Anyway. The scary version of Jack Frost, which i never seen, but... I just know that it would be a good Christmas music that you could show, like, all your brothers and sisters. They're like, yeah, Santa Claus saved me! And they'll realize he's not real! It saddens me that Santa Claus isn't real. I still like to believe. Oh, crap. I am gonna die. Come on. Come on. Go up. Go up. <sighs> awesome. Ah, Gotta swim. I wonder if Sonic can swim. I remember when they could swim in Super Smash Bros. Brawl. I wish that would have came out th around the Christmas season. Because it would have just made my Christmas complete. That was a fun game, by the way. But some people didn't like it. I don't know why, because they're just jerks. Ah, oh, crap. Is this the boss? I gotta fight a boss underwater. Ah. Do I get infinity health? Obviously not. What the heck? I'm supposed to jump on these? Shoot! Crap, crap, crap! I need air! Ha-ha! Ha-ha! Ah, crap! I'm gonna get the last laugh, Eggman! Die! Dan Green fights Eggman! Or Dr. Robotnik, as they go by the name now, because they think it's better to be retro in Sonic Team. By the way, they're making a new game called Project Needle Mouse. Well, it's a new Sonic game, but that's what they're just titling it right now. Yeah, I got another hit on him. And... I think it's going to be a pretty good game, but it's only going to be released for uh, PS3's uh, portable PlayStation Network and Xbox Arcade, so it's probably going to be a quick game. But either way, yeah, that's my Christmas list, you guys. I got like an N64 my uh, when I was in like the second or first grade. I got me a GameCube when I was like in middle school, and I got a Wii when I was in high school. Ah, it's a Nintendo extravaganza for TK. Yeah, I wasn't a really big fan of Sega. I always left that up to my brother. And a PS, PS whatever. But now that I got a PS3, there's really no games that I really want for it. So I don't know what I'm going to get for Christmas, because we still haven't opened our presents yet. Or at least we didn't. I didn't get any yet. Well, I did get a few, but I mean, like, they weren't games. They were just little trinkets and shit. <laughs> But anyway, hopefully I get like a ton of cash, because I really want to just go out and spend it on some car insurance. See, now that's how you definitely know Santa Claus ain't real, because he didn't bring me any car insurance this year. Ah, uh, damn you, insurance. Anyway, you guys know what to do. Write to me, subscribe to me. Prepare to see some more videos by TK. And maybe tomorrow I'll make a Kwanzaa video because I still got to celebrate that even though my daishiki is completely destroyed. But either way, you guys, see you guys. Write to me, subscribe to me. Merry Christmas from Turtle Kermit. See ya.